Hello YouTubers and welcome to DealsPrime.com review channel. Today we're going to be doing a really special review and it's for the i5 Mini 4. And uh, this is a quad core rock chip uh, RK3288 CPU tablet PC. And why is this so special? It's because uh, the RK3288 CPU it actually clocks in at about 1.8 gigahertz, which makes it faster than most, uh, if not all, uh, octa-core CPUs out on the market. Some of the cool things about this uh, tablet is that it has a 7.9 inch IPS retina screen with 2048 by 1536 pixel resolutions. And uh, this is also, uh, it, this what used to be pre-order. So the pre-order model was 2 gigabytes DDR3 RAM plus 16 gigabyte ROM. This is actually 2 gigabyte uh, RAM plus 32 gigabyte ROM. So there has been a memory up upgrade. While this test is running, I just want to remind you to like our video. Also, subscribe to the dealsprime.com review channel, and there should be a link to this uh, i5 Mini 4 inside of your YouTube video description. Now, just make sure that the link is clicking to dealsprime.com because we will have a special offer, a promo gift. So, to make sure that you're able to get this uh, promo gift that we'll be showing a little bit later, make sure that it goes to dealsprime.com. If not, you can just type in dealsprime.com and then do a search for i5 Mini 4. So uh, we'll try to make this an all-in-one review. We'll see. Uh, we have a 15-minute uh, limit, so uh, we'll see uh, how much we can fit in. Hopefully, we can get it all fit in to this one review. So this has a two-megapixel two camera on the front and five-megapixel camera on the back. So this is getting a nice, uh, really high score, which we like. It's uh, 37,950. Let's just check out the details, and then we'll go into device info. And uh, we actually maybe put. I like. I really like the box. Uh, I5. They always have really colorful box uh, designs. So that's one cool thing about them. Okay, so this is an uh, running Android 4.4.2. So it's KitKat operating system. Again, two gigabytes DDR3 RAM with about half of that free. And uh, again, a quad core 1.8 gigahertz CPU and a Mali T764 GPU. And uh, we'll check out device info. So uh, this is the i5 Mini 4, again a uh, KitKat, and uh, it does have root access. That does not mean that it comes rooted. You have to do the root on your own. 32 gigabytes ROM with about 26 gigabytes free. 300 DPI, and 320 DPI on the screen. This is the firmware uh, information. It was last updated on August 25th. So uh, truly, uh, really, uh, the latest firmware, in the, and you can just see it's like a really new release. There it is, August 25th. So maybe what, five days ago. And here are the uh, the sensors that it does and does not support. So you can pause your screen on any of the uh, results here. And again, this gets a nice score of 37,950. Now, uh, it, it, Antutu does not say, it didn't say anything about the uh, about the camera, but again, uh, it does have two, a dual camera, so a 2 megapixel camera here on the front, and then a 5 megapixel camera here on the back. There's a uh, 5 i5 Mini 4, and a uh, pretty simple design, uh, aluminum housing, speaker on the back here, and let's just show you the, the build of the tablet, then we then we'll show you the accessories, the free YouTube promo gift, and then we'll uh, go in depth. So uh, one thing I really like about i5 tablets is that they're really thin. You can see it's a nice and thin, slim tablet. And the other thing I like is the is the, the the bezel. They have a nice shiny bezel on the on the corner. Let's check out the ports real quick. So actually at the bottom here, you can see it says that it says 32 gigabyte. So this is a 32 gigabyte model. And at the top here, we have a power slash sleep button, micro SD card slot, micro USB port, 3.5 millimeter headphone jack, and this looks like it's the pinhole reset button right here. So if you need to reset the tablet for any reason, you can gently press this uh, button with the pin or a needle. So a pretty simple, nice, uh, simple design. And uh, before we go in depth, let's just actually check out what comes inside the box. So uh, take this, put this tablet to the left a little bit. Okay. 
Okay, so this does look like it has a, a English quick start guide, which is I think it's the first for i5. So again, it's just showing you kind of uh, the. Uh, see, it looks like one is the microphone. So that is not the pinhole reset button. That's actually uh, the mic hole. So do not press that button. It doesn't look like it has a reset button. But yeah, this again is really simple uh, information. Just some of the basic specs which we already have in our YouTube which we already have in our uh, product description so it's dual Chinese and English so just really simple stuff I'm talking about the icons and we'll show you this stuff inside the uh, the, the, the second part of this review did I mention so it's only 7.5 millimeters thick and a 5600 milliamp battery so that should probably get you around uh, four to five hours of use, hopefully. And inside the box, uh, there is a uh, data cable and a wall charger. So this is all that it comes with from i5, but we will have a promo gift. So uh, this inner carton, it will not ship out with the package because we actually we're going to be using bubble wrap to, to protect the screen during uh, shipping. So uh, the accessories, it get a wallet charger. This is an i5 branded charger, and it's 5 volt 2 amp and then input is 100 to 240 volts this is a US style plug now if you're in Europe, the, uh, Australia or the UK it will come with your country's power plug adapter free only from DiosPrime.com and again uh, the uh, the data cable for either plugging into the wall charger or to the to your computer to transfer files and when you order from Dios Prime, we'll actually include a free uh, promo case and here it is, it's an 8 inch uh, neoprene case with a nice 10 dollar value. Now in order to get this case, they'll make sure to ask us to please include the free YouTube promo case or the free YouTube uh, neoprene case and you can do that in the order notes section during checkout. Now in order to see the order notes section, you actually need to uh, go to dealsprime.com, register on dealsprime.com and then log in and check out through our website. So uh, make sure you, and then you'll see the order notes section, you can ask, make that request there. If you want to make any other requests, like uh, if you if you want to, you know, it, this does support multi language, so uh, we show you the languages. But like if you want us to declare like a lower value for customers, you can also customs. You can also do that inside the ordinal section. We we do that anyways, but just if you want to make sure. Okay, now let's uh, get ready for in depth. Uh, again, like our video, subscribe, and uh, let's continue. Okay, so uh, we, uh, we the Antutu Big Smart it actually does not come pre-installed, so uh, we we uh, download that on our own camera. So we actually check out the camera and take a picture of uh, we take a picture of the Quick Start Guide. It has some cool art. So this actually looks like it could be a higher uh, pixel. It looks like it could be like at least well, it's definitely five megapixel, but it looks like it could be maybe even eight. So a nice and clear uh, camera. It's uh, really hard to find a camera that's uh, especially on a tablet because sometimes when you take a picture, uh, and I'm not just trying to sell stuff because I, I do reviews like daily. Sometimes when you try to take a picture with a camera or phone, especially during a review, like the 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 picture comes out a little bit blurry. And uh, with this, this is this like really straightforward. I didn't have to like focus a lot. It was just kind of like it was almost like it was auto focus. So big uh, uh, ups to uh, i5 for getting that the camera a good camera on there. And maybe it's also the firmware, uh, the the user interface that they have. As you can see it's pretty uh, pretty unique. So again, this is KitKat, but you can see that they have their own little UI here. So uh, let's see. At the top here, it looks like we have uh, this is like the i5 market. So that this is in Chinese, but uh, check out some of the other things that they have here. This is kind of cool. You can see the pictures. Your pictures. Uh, you have a music, like a little jukebox there, and then uh, looks like that's music video player. So this is actually uh, looks like it's a i5 uh, promo video.
so you can see that this does have a really wide viewing angle. Again, it's a retina screen, so nice and uh, vivid. Loudspeaker as well. So again, uh, the i5 skin in it um, the, it's basically like the UI that it that it has the special UI. So great audio, great video on this unit. Camera, and then this is settings. So we'll go into settings in, in a bit, but uh, again, we just this kind of is kind of Windows esque the way that they have these different uh, things here that you can uh, choose. So actually, the screen was not even all the way bright. So. Uh, that's maybe why the video and maybe seemed a little bit dim. But it's actually kind of a dim video anyway, so. So it looks like it's, it has a sharp LG, uh, sharp LG, uh, IPS screen, which is, uh, it's one of the, the better quality ones. Again, it's a retina screen tablet. So we'll actually uh, get out of here. And uh, so yeah, nice again, nice little control panel, Bluetooth. And here are the apps, the icons. Again, it has Play Store. So let's go into settings real quick and then we'll do, get to some web browsing. So again, Bluetooth. Uh, check out About Tablet. So this, again, firmware was last updated on uh, August 25th, so this is basically the same stuff that Antutu was telling us. Check out all the languages. And again, this is just for our international viewers, which is a lot. It's, uh, many of our customers are, our audience is, uh, oops. Uh-oh, looks like this may be Hindi. Okay, so... Yeah, it's pretty easy to change the tablet back to English or to your to your language. So here are the, all the apps. So there's 1.7 gigabytes free here. You can see at the bottom window here. And on the cord, there's uh, 26 gigabytes. So that's about 28 gigabytes out of uh, 32 gigabytes free. And here are all the. This is RAM. So 1.9 gigabytes free, and then one gigabyte used for the RAM. And here are all the apps. So we'll just scroll through all the apps real quick. Then we'll get ready for some uh, web browsing. Play Store. Sound Recorder. System UI, which is, uh, again, KitKat. Now let's get to some uh, web browsing, and then we'll uh, wrap up this review. Again, we'll just check out the, uh, we actually have a couple windows open now. So, actually, it was, I think it was from when we were uh, downloading in Tutu. So, definitely nice, uh, fast, uh, 1.8 gigahertz CPU on this. You can see a nice panda bear there, and again the retina screen. And we'll just go to a couple other sites. We'll go to Duos Prime. So when you tap, you can. It sounds like there is a tapping noise, which you can probably uh, adjust and. Uh, And uh, we'll just go to a couple other sites as well, other than our own site. <laughs> okay, so uh, this just about uh, wraps up this review. And uh, if um, again, there should be a link to this uh, tablet inside of. Uh, to the i5 mini 4 inside of your YouTube video description instead of our YouTube video description but if not you can just do a search for i5 uh, mini 4 and you'll be able to find that okay guys well uh, this just about wraps up this review uh, make sure to like our video subscribe and uh, thanks for watching remember to ask for the gift